Hi everyone, I'm Heidi and welcome to Shape Your Future Healthy Kitchen sponsored by TSAT. I am here with Chef Val. Thank you for joining me. She is from the OUTU School of Community Medicine. I can't wait to eat this. So tell me what we're making. So we're making a date brand quick bread. So okay. everybody should be looking to get more fiber in your diet and this is an easy way to do it. Yes. And this is a very um, quick and easy recipe as the quick bread title suggests. Right. So we're starting with some whole wheat flour. We're gonna add some coconut sugar, which is just a less processed sweetener, but you could totally sub with brown sugar or even okay. white granulated sugar. And again, this is just for what you need, dietary needs. Right. That's the best part of doing things at home. That's right. Mm -hmm. And so we have some leaveners, well, actually a little salt in there, but baking powder, baking soda. We're gonna give that a little whisk just to stir up our dry ingredients a little bit. And then we actually have some brand bud cereal that we have um, softened in some boiling water. Okay. And so that's going to go right in. And that's just a blend better. That's the recommendation versus obviously straight out of the box. It's a little crispy. <laughs> right. So that is actually going to help it be distributed um, through the, the muffins or quick bread if you decide to make a loaf pan okay. of it. <clears throat> and that's something you'll need to adjust the cooking time to if you decide to make muffins or quick bread, but we'll put that in the recipe. Good point. That will cook a little faster in the muffin pans. And then we've got some canola oil and some, this is oat milk. You could use almond milk, soy milk, regular cow's milk. Perfect. That was going to be my next question. Again, sure. you're adjusting as needed. Right. And then we've used a flax egg before, but we're going to use flax eggs again. And that's just ground flax seed that um, at a ratio of three to one water to ground flax seed, you soak this and all of the flax seeds, um, they kind of gel. They soak up the water and make a gel mm -hmm. and it acts like an egg does whenever you're baking. And I would imagine the flax seeds probably giving you a little more health benefit than an egg or is it more just dietary? It is definitely um, high in omega-3s, and so that's a great way to sneak those into your diet. Okay. So this is just going to get really well mixed together. And you don't want to over-mix a quick bread um, because it can be tough, but we have... Um, Does that help in keeping it more moist or more dense? Um, the, the stirring. Right. When you mentioned that, you don't want to over-stir. Right. So if you over-stir it, it actually works the gluten in the flour, and it makes it tough. Okay. Yes. And then we have some chopped dates and you can buy these already chopped or you could chop them yourself. Mm -hmm. And these just get folded in. Okay. In the interest of time, we're just going <laughs> to, we're just going to go like this. Exactly. That's totally fine. Okay. And so these are going to get folded in and we're going to put them in these. Um, Into the muffin. Right. And again, this is different than if you were doing a loaf pan. You want to just change the time a little bit. That's right. And if you had a portion scoop, like mm -hmm. a, what, you know, you might call it an ice cream scoop. That's a great way to get these neatly into your muffin tins. But you wanna fill those about three quarters full. Okay. Then they go right into the oven. Perfect, so it's super easy. And Very it's a great easy. snack, breakfast, anything of anything like that to get exactly. your fiber in. Exactly, send it with your kids, school lunches. This is a great way to incorporate those. And now I get to taste it. Okay. <laughs> it looks amazing as always with everything. And it's so moist and it's very, very good. If you want to learn more about this recipe or any other recipes, go ahead and go to kjrh.com. Thank you.